programming, this program, uh, we hope that you do. No amount is too small, no amount is too large. Uh, the underground microphone is partially funded by the Overlook Estate Foundation. We're ever so grateful for that support. And that just shows us that, you know, this kind of programming is so important to our community. So we're gonna turn it right, right on over to Ms. You take it from here, Ms. Sounds good. Uh, just, you know, wanna say thanks to Maria and the Cultural Center. You guys have just always been so good to me over the years and uh, that place has a special place in my heart. So thank you so much. And I uh, hope everybody's doing well out there. Hope you guys are uh, safe and well during these weird times. This is a brand new song and it's called Only Human. on that uh, something like that <laughs> hey um hope you guys can hear it okay and um, welcome to my living room here uh, thanks for tuning in out there I'm, whenever I do the live streams I'm used to being being able to 
see the comments and uh, I can't see them today so um, I won't be able to, re to respond to you guys I usually usually enjoy talking to everybody but uh, I'll stick to just playing songs this time so uh, uh, this is the first song I, I wrote when I moved to Nashville one of them anyway but uh, this one's called Six Ways from Sunday Six ways from Sunday. Boy, it's getting hot in my house. Gonna take off this uh, this shirt here. Warm day out today. I was outside all day. I was, just got back from downtown to a nice uh, 
little song right, and uh, it's like almost 70 degrees down here, and sunny. Can't beat it. Uh, I'm going to grab this other guitar here and uh, play another brand new song for you guys. Make sure this thing's in tune. Close enough. Finger pick this one. This one's called Adios. Driving fields, there's no turning around. The way your eyes told what you would say, undermining in a casual way. Eggshells and broken glass, footsteps on frozen grass, there's no turning around. There's no turning around You just push that pedal down And you know you won't be coming back this time There's no turning around Nothing left here for me now It's just the motor's lonely sound And I feel fine So adios forever Things they never did get better Adios Forever goodbye. I know it should have been so plain to see. Cause everybody knew the truth of me. It takes everything you've got to leave. One day, eventually, there's just no turning around. There's no turning around. You just push that pedal down And you know you won't be coming back this time There's no turning around Nothing left here for me now It's just the motor's lonely sound And I feel fine So adios forever I just couldn't stand the weather Adios forever Goodbye there's a little corner in a roadside bar Where I'll pass away the time Sometimes wonder where you are Maybe someday soon I'll come to see The bright side of things But tonight I'm just a lonely Melody for broken hearts to sing All right. 
thanks guys. Kind of a deep song. <sighs> what do we got next? Um, here's, here's one you guys might know. Hey, uh, thanks for listening to original, original tunes and, uh, you know, being interested in, in the songs that I write and some of the things I have to say. It means a lot to me. And uh, I really, you know, I, I always say this. Um, I'll, I'll talk for a minute while I tune here. But, you know, I always talk about, you know, down here in, in Tennessee where I live, you know, everybody's kind of from different areas of the country. And, you know, when you meet somebody, you're like, oh, where are you from? And, and it could be any number of, you know, states or whatever. But, uh, you know, people ask me where I'm from. And, and I always say Scranton. You know, I was born, born at CMC. And, uh, and then, of course, they mentioned the office. <laughs> but when all that's said and done, um, I always talk about how much I love Scranton, the Wyoming Valley, Northeast Pennsylvania, and the people that live there. And, uh, you know, when I, when I moved down here, um, it, in no way, shape, or form was I um, trying to skip town or, or get away from anything or anything like that. I just wanted to kind of explore you know writing music and seeing seeing music and learning from other guitar players and you know it was kind of a happening scene down here but uh i always mention how much i love northeast pa and i really mean that with all my heart i absolutely love it never talk a bad word word about it and um just say nothing about you know nothing but good things about it and, and i genuinely mean that i love it back home Really miss it up there. I don't miss uh, clouds and snowfall for six months, but <laughs> but uh, other than that, I love it. So uh, ah, where'd my pick go? Here it is. So uh, here's one you guys always request, request, and this one's called Wink.
like the fuse and we can our separate ways Thorns and bickers thick and thin are made to pierce your smooth and skin Today Too many tears I have now shed To wonder where they all come from Too many nights I slept lying by the phone Cause I still want you around There's still that story in your eyes I just don't care how it ends I feel compelled to turn the page I can't seem to comprehend Cause I'm still waiting for the wind Through the eyes that never Well never once did I blink I got the hint before the I'm still waiting for the wind With open eyes I never blink 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 Thanks, guys. Can you hear me, Mike? Yeah, it looks like Maria wants to uh, chime in there. Hey, Maria. Just real quick. Hey. Yeah. Can you all hear me? All right. Well. I can. So the gang, <laughs> the gang is all here. So like the whole gang. <laughs> Number cool. one fan. Who do, you think, who do you think was first? Who do you think was first? Oh man, I don't know. There's a little delay. First comment. Uh, Ange is here, and Sherry, and Patrick, and John Chimo, and Luli Guacamole, and yeah, the whole gang's here. So everybody's loving it. So 70 degrees, man, huh? Really? You're rubbing it I mean, it, was, it had to be at least 65. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. You got a, you got a green light on that one. Yeah, we got some snow today, so we just thought we'd bring you all home to warm us all up. What do you think of that? I'm cool with that. So, cool with that. Andrew was asking, so we is there going to be an album coming out? Soon? Well, sometime. Oh, okay. So I have uh, two singles definitely coming out soon, and and a little cool little video and, and some different stuff with that. Um, I don't want to um, say too much, but uh, you know, I I spent the weekend in in Muscle Shoals. And um, wow. needless to say, I'm going to be uh, heading back down there in March. And uh, some really, really great things happened this last weekend. And, um, you know, it's, look, it's looking pretty good. It's looking good for a full album very soon. And uh, I'm going to – I got some people that are going to work on it that are, that are really awesome. And I'm really excited about it. So I'll be leaking little bits of information out here in the next coming couple weeks. So. Stay tuned. Well, I'm sure I'm sure nobody here is surprised by any of that, like all all that good stuff. Um, so I would like to know that maybe tonight we'll get a little sneak preview along the way, but that's up to you. No pressure. No pressure. Um, what else have you been up to? <laughs> You've been doing a lot of writing. Yeah, uh, I've been on a you know a creative creative streak for sure. Um, you know, I had COVID. Uh, you know, um, like prior to Christmas. And um, that, you know, kind of sucked. It wasn't too bad. I'm, I'm grateful, I'm thankful, but uh, you know, I, I do have an antibodies for it now. So um, it, it is nice that after, after having it, I've been able to kind of, uh, you know, go get back out into life and, and work with people again. And, you know, I'm still super careful about it, the whole thing, wear the mask and all that, of course. But uh, it has been nice. I've been playing a lot of songwriters rounds. I'm playing another one tomorrow night here in town. I might go live on Facebook tomorrow from this round. Me and a uh, um, couple couple great people, and uh, I've been writing with a few different people in town, and um, just staying real busy, playing playing lots of guitar, writing lots of songs. Really, really cool. Tell us real quick about the record label. That's new, relatively. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Really, really cool things. You know, I didn't think that something like that was going to come out of quarantine. But, uh, uh, you know, very long story short, I, I met the, the one of the label owners. Her name is Elena Thefford. And uh, she uh, was good friends with an old roommate of mine, another great songwriting partner. And she used to stop over the house. We had this house over by Shelby Park. And, and uh, you know, we'd play, play her the songs we were working on. And, you know, she seemed to like it. So it was cool to kind of get a call from her, like, you know, eight months later down the road. And she kind of put the offer out on the table, and uh, she's done some great things. I mean, she used to manage Margot Price, and if you, some of you guys know who Mar Margot is, wow. and, you know, and um, and her label partner is is you know real involved in like syncing and licensing with with movies and stuff. But uh, he's also BB King's nephew, <laughs> which is pretty cool. So wow. um, that's cool. So yeah, you know, we're gonna be putting music out this year for sure. I'm I'm raring to go. I actually kind of backed up the process because I wanted to shoot a video and put like I have a, a single and another like an acoustic version an electric version and I wanted to get all that straightened out so that's all finished now so now it's time to actually you know put it out into the world so these things take a little time it's been taking a little bit of time but you know it's coming so you put the work in and now you're ready to, to get it out there that's awesome so um, I'm Maria with the Scranton Cultural Center I'm live here in the Raymond Hood room um, with tonight's presentation of Underground Microphone. Thrilled to have this live remote going from Nashville uh, with Mike Miz, who's, uh, who's sitting in with us tonight and sharing his lovely songs. So we're at the halfway point, which I can't believe how fast that went in a blink. And um, are you, I don't know, if, are you ready, Mike, to, to start back up? Oh yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what song I was gonna play because as as usual, I wrote down too many songs, so I'm trying to pick and choose here. Yeah, but, uh, you always do that. <laughs> We're gonna turn it right back on over. Give it up for Mike Miz. <laughs> hey, thanks, guys. Here's another oldie for you guys. I'm 
yesterday Packed the car and drove away But the engine gave it, I got stuck I hitched your out when I broke down You still can't do that in this town If you were born with any luck I saw a face that looked familiar It was dark as I think I've seen before So I lifted up the hill Stop lighting up a candle I saw a face I thought I'd never seen before So I saw the last week I saw a little man All right, little tornado mine. That one somehow uh, never ended up on an album. I don't know why. I don't know how. I have to do something about that. And uh, whew, a little out tune here. Play play another one. You guys might know. You know, we, we lost a lot of great people this year, and, and the list is, there's too many to count. There's too many. So, um... I want to send this one out to, um, to anybody who's out there, you know, working on the front lines, working in the healthcare industry. Because, um, you know, if, if... You know, if there's any rock stars in the world, it's you guys, for sure. And, um, you know, I, I don't have enough words to describe the amount of, amount of respect I have for, for the doctors and the nurses that have been working this whole pandemic. So uh, I'm not sure the words of this song are exactly fitting, but um, you guys sure are heroes to me, that's for sure. So <clears throat> this tune's called Heroes. On your back, don't ever worry, just keep wandering that way. Brief is our time upon this earth, don't underestimate the gift you have each day. And don't ever change, just be yourself. And don't burn your dreams for someone else. Cry if you wanna cry And sing if you wanna sing And love if you wanna love You're all you got And that's good enough Now it's time you shine like all you can I will go on now that my heroes are gone and Now silence fills my window sills My bedroom floors and dresser drawers don't seem the same I search the dawn in all its glory for some need But all I hear back is your name they skipped a heartbeat on the street The world kept shuffling in its feet So cry if you want to cry And sing if you want to sing And love if you want to love You're all you got that's good enough. Now it's time you shine like all you can. I will go on. Now that my heroes are gone.
song it's been rewritten a few times so this is the, the newest version I like this version and this one's called the hurricane song Yeah. 
dancing the Albuquerque. Hey, something like that. <clears throat> Man, oh man. Had a long day today. Woke up uh, woke up nice and early and went for a seven mile run. And uh, I'm starting to feel it now. <laughs> but it was worth it. Yeah, we'll do this one. This one's called Hell in the Hallway. Goes like this. tuning in. I think we got time for what? Maybe two more? Something like that? Yeah, okay. All right. I'm going to play it. I'm going to play it until Maria Maria gives me the, the cutest stop. <laughs> Here's a good one. Here comes a good one. <clears throat> I, uh, I played this song the other night uh, down here in, in Nashville. At a writer's round, and uh, it was the first time I played it for like you know the sort of the crew down here. And everybody loved it, man. It made me feel good. I like this song a whole bunch. Uh, it's an, 
another one of my songs about skipping town, you know, which uh, I tend to do from time to time. And uh, this one's called Tail Lights. <laughs> like a Jim Crow CD-esque, but like, <clears throat> I mean, yeah, so, compared like to, so Miz, yeah, I didn't mean to do that, that, but like, no, yeah, I didn't, mean, I, didn't, I didn't mean to compare, because I don't like to do that, but like, it had like a, a Jim Crow G-esque to it. My, my uncle went to uh, Villanova with him. He knew him. That's crazy. I'm a huge know, Jim right? Croce fan. Like, like totally. I'm a huge Jim Croce fan. So when anybody says that, it means a lot to me. I, I wish I could sing half as good as that guy did. Well, you're right. You're right. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're, you're doing it. Um, we want to thank everybody for tuning in because like they're, my phone is like exploding over here. Everybody's clapping and singing. And I was just thinking about yeah. this because um, I know that like half this crew knows all of your songs by heart. So, like, what does it feel like when you look out in the audience and you see people in the audience singing your tunes? 
I mean, that's, that's one of the best feelings in the world. And, uh, you know, I'm glad you mentioned that, too. I was at a write earlier. You know, I've been writing songs around town here pretty much every day. I'm writing with somebody. And um, we were talking about how writing songs is the, is the greatest drug in the world. It really is. And it happened earlier where when you, <clears throat> when you write a song and, and then you see it connect with someone, whether it's people singing in a crowd or whether it's like an email you might get or just uh, somebody that approaches you and tells you that it, you know, it touched them in a certain way or, you know, it, it made them feel a certain way or it helped, especially when people say it, it helps them. You know, that's like the greatest drug in the world. This really cool thing happens. I used to talk, talk about this with my buddy Alan back in the day. But, you know, when you're writing a song and you get to sometimes you get the chills because you realize you you tapped into something that's kind of beyond you. You know, you tapped into, you know, whatever you want to call it, inspiration. And uh, that's a really good sign. And that happened to me earlier today, writing. We just came up with this really clever line, which is a great line. And uh, we were like, oh, my God, I got the chills. And it's such a great feeling. And <clears throat> it's been cool. It's been, it's been cool to be able to, like I said before, I just am so grateful that people are even halfway interested in what I do. It, it means so much to me. It's really cool. It's Keeps me moving. Amazing. I know that yeah. any kid, any kid in Heroes, that just makes me fall in a corner. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> we're uh, we're the time is flying, man. It's flying fast. Um, I'm Maria with the Scranton Cultural Center. I'm live here in the Raymond Hood room, and we are joined uh, by Mike Miz in his living room. Uh, so thrilled and grateful that you're able to sit with us tonight. Um, thank you all for tuning in, and thanks for all of your support. Once again, Underground Mike is partially funded by the Overlook Overlook State Estate Foundation. I can't talk tonight. The Overlook Estate Foundation, um, and we're very grateful to have that kind of support. So, if anyone is inclined to join in on that support, we'd appreciate that too. I'm going to throw it back to you, Ms. We've got uh, a good four or five minutes, so if you want to fill that on in and say good night, Gracie. You can say good night after that. Cool. Sounds good. I got. Should I play one more song? <clears throat> uh, we got a good four or five minutes. Four or five. Yeah, yeah. Forty-five. <laughs> no, no, yeah. Give, let me, let me play this one, let me more, play this one more song. <laughs> hey, thanks so much. Um, hey, last question for all you guys out there. I'm a little bit colorblind. Is this is this wall blue or black? Because we we can't figure it out. I think it's black. Um, so let us know what you think. <laughs> and uh, thanks again for tuning in. I love you guys. Miss y'all. Uh, make sure you follow me on the old social medias, Mike Miz Music, Miz Music, you'll find me. And, uh, you know, keep in touch. Hope to see everybody in person soon. And uh, just want to thank Maria again. And it's been a great time. So uh, here's the last quick song. This one's called When You Love Somebody. And uh, we'll see you real soon. Okay, guys?
couple years, been a good few nights, had a few good laughs, couple pretty good fights. But maybe you and me, we got a history, and that's everything to me. When you love somebody, the world comes to life. When you love somebody, the stars all shine. When you love somebody, your dreams come true. When you love somebody, Thanks, everybody. We'll see you real soon. Thanks, Scranton Cultural Center. You guys all stay safe out there and take care of each other, all right?